Well, with the school year ending in less than a month, teachers at a private school in Milledgeville found out they will be losing their jobs. Our Kayla Solomon walks you through how and why some parents are now stepping in to help. On Tuesday morning, teachers at the Sinclair Christian Academy were told that the school will be closing its doors. On top of them losing their jobs, they also may not be paid the remaining time of their contract. Laurel Tucker's son Aiden is a first grader at Sinclair Christian Academy. Said to the people as he was walking out how sad he was that that this was happening. Today he came home from school with this letter. The board has decided not to reopen Sinclair Christian Academy for the next school year. Tucker and other parents heard the news earlier in the day, but instead of just figuring out what comes next for their kids, they decided to try to help the teachers too. I mean, almost immediately we thought about, you know, the teachers and, you know, how, how can they financially, you know, move past this and some other parents and I decided that we really need to do a GoFundMe account um, to try to get some financial support. The GoFundMe entitled Hoodwinked on Teacher Appreciation Day is going straight to the teachers and parent Stacy Harris says they deserve it. The fact that the teachers aren't getting paid is what really just it just hurts my heart because they are so passionate about what they do and they and it shows they they go above and beyond. She also says she and the other parents will continue to help here. I'm just here to advocate for these amazing women and men who who come to work every day just for the love of these kids and for the love of Christ. I reached out to leadership both at the school and the Sinclair Baptist Church and they said they have no comment at this time. In Milledgeville, Kayla Solomon, 13 WMAZ News. Well, the school has around 90 students enrolled and the last day of school for students is May 24th.